new obstacle for her this year, but she's making short work of it. On to the fourth one, through to the fifth one, and look at that, no hands, all right. And onto the balance beam. She's pretty familiar with this. No scaredy cats this time. And now onto a new obstacle, the teeter log. She's got a big crowd here today cheering her on. And whoa, almost falls off there. Now onto the cargo climb. Very quickly up the cargo climb, up to the top, over the log. Crosses over the first shed through the grocery cart conference table. Now that's the second cart reference we've seen there. Not really sure what that is. Must, uh, must be an inside joke. All right, now she's on her way down the second shed on the roof, onto the platform, across the bridge, and onto the zip line. Once again, she has a lot of her stuffed animal friends out here to cheer her on in the course today. And here she goes. Oh my goodness, and look at that. One-handed over the water bottles. And she makes it, no problem. Now, onto the hanging steps at Christmas Tree Corner. There is every Christmas tree that Lila has decorated in her five years. Kind of a strange collection, but uh, also kind of cool, I guess. She's working her way through this very tough section that requires a lot of concentration. It, whoa, almost falls off there. That was very close, but she regains her balance and got a big smile on her face. And she's done it. Now, on to the next obstacle actually named by Lila, the log thingies. She makes it look easy, even skipping a few at the end there. Now she's on her way to the warp wall, getting a running start. And yes, she's made it up the warp wall. Two minutes and 23 seconds and she's on her way to Vegas.